Governor Tim Walz is expected to announce the decision on fall school in less than two weeks, and some school workers are concerned about the unknown status of their jobs. Kate Raddatz is live outside St. Louis Park High School with more. And Kate, a lot of questions leading up to this decision. And obviously this decision affects a lot of people. It affects students, teachers, their parents, uh, but this will also affect other workers, the workers in schools, workers that uh, are working for schools, and they're concerned that they are being forgotten in this situation, in this decision. These workers I'm talking about, their employees like bus drivers, maintenance workers, and special ed paras that they all have spoken out this morning about their concerns. One of them is that they have never been eligible, they say, for unemployment during the summer months. They say there is a state law that prevents hourly school workers from getting summer unemployment because typically they have pretty good assurance that they will have work again in the fall. That is something they have been fighting for years, but this year with COVID, many hourly school employees are also out of work as summer programs have been canceled. These workers are also upset that they still do not know the status of fall school. It's obviously just a matter of weeks away now, and they want to know if they will have jobs and and if they'll have adequate supplies. We're in limbo not knowing whether or not or how we can do this safely. And we're in limbo for no paychecks. These folks need unemployment and they need it now. I did reach out to the office of Governor Walls and the Minnesota Department of Employment and Economic Development and I'm waiting to hear back. We do expect a decision on schools by July 27th. Okay, a lot of parents and staff anxiously awaiting this decision. Kate, thank you.